Hey, it's Flat Brett here, and I've just got some more custom to show you people because I haven't made a video in quite a while. I think, yeah, so I've got about, I don't know, I've got loads. Um, starting off, I've got a custom security trooper, commander, blah blah blah. It's okay. Not my best one. Um, paint advisor, legs. Um, body, arms, torso. So, yeah. He's okay. He's the best. Um, next I have, where is he? Commander Neo, in Clone Wars version. I just found that old helmet which I had painted over and decided to change it to give it some clone he had painted and yeah uh, new my new design of doing the clone wars legs like that um piston and gun kind of smudge there annoyingly uh if i showed you these other two are called scope and Daltus. these are yeah they are neo's troops they were in my last video and the headlamps are sawn down yeah. Um, next is my matchstick. New one. Just changed the helmet. Everything else is the same. And the arms are different. Um, back of the helmet. That's where the two pipes are going. And down. Yeah, the front of the body is a decal. And so is there. But I rarely use decals. So. Yeah. Um, next is. I'm going too fast, just pause it because I'm just trying to get through this quickly because I've got quite a few to show you. Next is a 501st Airborne Trooper custom moulded helmet. Well, not moulded, just crafted out of modelling clay. Out of a Lego City biker helmet. Out. I don't know if I've got one around here. No, I don't. But you can probably. It's one of the. If you can see inside. Mm, one of the biker ones you get like in police sets or from Lego City. Um, a waste cap I got off eBay. Yeah, okay, not the best. You have to come down. Um, backpack. Uh, yeah, not really much. Um, custom Kashi scout. I think it looks really cool. Um, put black in the mouthpiece and. A little black line on top of the helmet, which they have. Um, legs, instead of having the grey ones, again green and sharpened them. Body. Um, my custom back. I use these as a lot of backpacks. They're kind of like clone commando packs. Because they, they just look a lot like them. I think they look really cool. So if you use them, give credit to me. Because I think I'm the first to do it. If not, just tell me. And I don't care really. But. If you, if I am the first, just tell me if you have used them. God, I'm getting mixed up. Just if you use them, give me credit, okay? Um, so that's him. Um, next I have um Commander Stone. Oh, I showed you him. Um, oh yeah, here we are. It's Commander Ryan from Clone Army Customs. He's not that great. The body's messed up and the helmet's not really good ish part but I'll remake him because this one's absolutely horrible. Um back of binoculars is just a visor cut down the front and the bottom here. Um painted and put glue some plastic on the front. Like that. Um, yeah. Um who else? Um just trying to find it one second please. Oh here we are. Um, Commander, um, Lieutenant Pine, he is under the command of Commander Ryan. Go figure. Um, painted, um, the helmet is the hardest part, I think, because I did it by, um, painting a long grey stripe underneath the eyes. And then when it's dry, scraping off, which I think works better than painting it, because you, you can have more control over what shape you scrape it but yeah painted arms and the back and blah 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 um next i have 
my Dota squad again. Slight changes. Sorry. Someone's calling me on Skype. Um, boss. Yeah, I am selling all of my Delta squad on eBay. So if you want them, or not maybe on eBay. Yeah, just make an offer. Really, probably about. I'll say I sell them about twenty-five pounds. Twenty pounds. I'm not sure. It just depends. Really. Um. So I've got Scorch. Um, also, Scorch will come with a second helmet, which is a custom ventilator helmet, which is to for toxic gases and stuff. These grooves in the side and more metal and much better. Well, it's just cooler. So you get two helmets with Scorch, and they're all the blue shaded visors and everything. Um, who else? I've got my 501st Jet Trooper. Yeah, 501st Jet Trooper. You've seen before. Just show you again, really. I changed the um, body a bit, not much though. He's still pretty crap. Next and finally is my new Sig Fig, or myself. Um, probably he's a clone commando, just basically niner but darker. Um. He's based on the actual figure of Five Skitara or something like that. If you go look at it in this weird action figure pack, it looks exactly the same and I like the markings, so I've made it and I use it as me. But yeah, it's kind of sad. Oh well, um, custom made shotgun with a, it's a harpoon cut down with a hand and binoculars, kind of obvious. Um, it's the helmet. Um, I'm, it's not completely finished. The visor is paint blue, but yeah, still there. Yeah. Um, the legs are still under work, and not, they're not completely finished. I'll just scrape them down a bit and make them look a bit better. Um, body isn't a decal; it's all scraped and then sharpied and painted. Um, painted. I really like how the arms came out. They look really good. They look better. When you actually see it, not on camera, because that just messes it up. I don't know why. Um, other arm underneath and underneath the back is just the same as the front. Um, yeah, so that's really it. Um, now I'm going to tell you all about Arigo Squad 3. I'm sorry, but it's postponed. Um, because I've dropped the camera and the lens is smashed up and everything like that and it's not going to come back till late January, early February so and I, I've underestimated, uh, underestimated the entire film and it still needs about a month of filming to go i filmed 10 minutes of it so far and that's good but uh, so yeah it's postponed, I'm sorry, it's not going to be out on Christmas and my move maker's messed up, so it might be out really late because I need to get that working. If any of you have the 2000, the new Windows Vista version of Move Maker, and I've got a problem with it, but I part, I can make the film, and then when I click publish, it when it gets to the, sorry, when I get to the part where it, when it says um. Sorry about that. Um, I'm gonna get to the part about um, where it says estimating time remaining. It just freezes there and doesn't do any more progress. If you know how to fix that and anything, and then if you press cancel, it just freezes there as well. And I have to um, control or delete and close the program. And if you know how to fix it, that'd be very good. Just tell me. So yeah, thanks for watching. Um, sorry that's postponed. Um, please subscribe on both my channels. Bye.